a difficult night for players and supporters. Where, in your opinion, does that, does that leave the playoff hopes now? Well, I think after today we should not speak about the playoffs uh, and the playoffs hopes. Obviously, the hope will, will be there uh, as long as it is possible. But after a night like this where we made some horrendous mistakes in defending, some individual mistakes where we gave the ball too easy away, where we didn't follow our man, where we then lost our head, where we made free kicks quick, where we shouldn't, where we make throw-ins quick, where we shouldn't. Um, there, I think it's all about to make sure that we lift everybody because on, on Wednesday they are the next game. But on the other hand, we have to be very brutal to ourselves and uh, speak about the mistakes which we've done. If you make mistakes like we have done in which is mistakes like today, uh, you can't compete, especially not here, against a good borough side. And have you been able to pinpoint where and why those mistakes happened? No, to be fair, we made these mistakes in front of both goals, to be totally honest, because we had good opportunities when it was nil-nil. I think we started the game OK. Uh, we had a good opportunities where we went, when we went one nil down. Obviously, the second goal, which we conceded, um, was yeah, a little bit strange because uh, obviously our left fullback was uh, on the grass. So we were not able to um, continue and then they attacked this left side of us and uh, scored this goal. But at the end of the day, um, we have to, to, to solve the situations much more better. And that we lost our head uh, in situations where we were really... Um, Make it too easy for them. This is what, uh, what what disappoints me a lot. And obviously, the individual mistakes which we've done today uh, were too big. And you mentioned it is a quick turnaround to Wednesday again. What was your message in the dressing room? How do you restore confidence after a game like that? No, at the end of the day, I think everybody should feel the pain. Uh, sometimes this helps, and uh, we have to make sure that we come defensively back to our strength where the focus is on the highest and uh, you know you get uh, punished by opponents especially by opponents with the quality of, of borrow if you if you are not switched on uh, every single second and this was today our our fault we have to make this better for sure uh, and for this we have to speak honest about the mistakes which we've done and try everything to perform better especially defensively uh, like we have done today